Hello, my name's Duncan Stewart and I'm a proprietor of Scotland Overland. Thanks for your interest. I'm here today to explain our Land Rover Defenders, the features and equipment that they have. All of our Defenders are, as you see here, all long wheelbase Defender 110s of the same colour and specification, save for one thing. We have two models, that which we call the 2x2, which is this on the left here. This is equipped with two tents, each of sufficient size to accommodate two adults, four people in total. This is more popular with families with children, particularly teenagers, or indeed two couples traveling together. The one on the right hand side is the more popular model. It's got what is called the family tent, we call the four by one configuration. This is large enough, it's two meters wide and large enough to accommodate up to four adults. Otherwise, the cars are equipped identically and they have everything that you need to go and see the remotest parts of Scotland. So, this is the basic layout for all of our vehicles. Up on the roof, obviously, you have the tent, the awning and recovery boards, should the worst happen and you get stuck in the mud. Inside, we have, first and foremost, the fridge. The fridge freezer is maintenance free. It runs on its own battery and will never use the main car battery. Once it's got food and drink inside it, it will run for one, two days without starting the car to charge the battery. So there's nothing that you need to do. Down here we have chairs, as many chairs as there are people in the group, and also a little portable toilet, which I'll leave to you to figure out how to use. Up here we have sleeping bags, either three or four season sleeping bags, depending on the time of year, obviously as many sleeping bags as there are people in the group. A table, a big one for your dinner, charcoal barbecue here, and behind the barbecue, pillows, as many that, as, as many as there are in the group, and thermal sleeping bag liners, for if it's especially cold. Here we have 10 litres of drinking water, a crate for carrying your beer and your food, a gas stove, two ring burner, and gas canisters, which will always ensure that you've got sufficient gas to see you through the duration of your trip. In box number one, we have anything to do with food preparation or cooking. So all of your pots and pans, your plates, your cutlery is in there. In box number two, we have everything that isn't food related. So there you have your lantern, torch, first aid kit, electronic items, towels, shovel, you name it. This is your basic luggage area. We find soft bags work best for obvious reasons. Hard suitcases don't fit so well in here. But piled up, you'll get four large sports type bags, sufficient for four people. Mm -hmm.